stone remains where it is. Its place changes only if someone picks it up and moves it. It doesn't eat and doesn't grow bigger. It doesn't have babies either. On the other hand, sparrows build nests. They move here and there on their own. They eat insects and grains and they grow. They lay eggs in the nests. Little sparrows hatch from these eggs. Sparrows take a lot of care of their young ones. An eagle flies high in the sky. A cow walks on the ground. Fish swims in water. The elephant cannot run at any great speed. The deer has thin legs. It runs very fast. A frog's thin legs are long. So it can easily hop, jump and leap. The four main directions are east, west, north and south. The direction in which the sun rises is the east. The direction in which the sun sets is the west. East and west are opposite to each other. In this picture, the east is marked. Now west, north and south are marked as shown. We travel towards east to go from the ice cream shop to the bus stop. Amir wants to go to the ice cream shop. He must walk in west direction. Sarah wants to go to the bus stop. She must go to the north direction. At sunset, if you are facing east, your shadow will fall in the east direction. Second, circle the name of our district headquarters. Answer is Pune headquarters. First, find your district on the map and color it. Answer. Pune district. In the map of the world given above, color the part labeled India. Try this. Take two potted plants of equal growth. Label them as 1 and 2. Every morning for the next 5 days, water only plant 1. Do not water plant 2. What do you see? Plant 2, which was not watered, slowly dries up. Plant 1 looks fresh and green. Try this. Light a candle and stand it on a table. Look at it through a cardboard. Now look at the same candle through a glass pane. You cannot see the flame through the cardboard. But you can see it through the glass. Heat some water on a burner for some time. You will see that. The water begins to boil. Keep it boiling for some time and observe it. Using tongs, hold a steel plate in the steam coming from the water only for a few moments and remove it. You see that droplets of water have formed on it. When water becomes very cold, it freezes. That is, it turns into ice. When ice is left uncovered, it gets heat from the air around it. It melts, that is, it forms water. When water gets enough heat, it turns into vapor. When chapatis have been made and the griddle is still very hot, sprinkle a few drops of water. You will see that the drops sprinkled on the griddle become round like beads and disappear. Blow a balloon. You fill air into it. There is air all around us. Though we can feel it, we cannot see it. Air does not have color, smell or taste. Breathing. We breathe continuously. That is called respiration. Dip one end of the straw into the water. Through the other end, blow into it with your mouth. Bubbles rise up in the water. This picture shows puris being made. Puris have to be fried. Wood is being burnt to obtain the heat for frying. Many of our food items are prepared by heating. To cook rice, we add water to the rice and boil it. Puris, pakodas are fried. The part where the arm is joined to the torso 
is called the shoulder. The leg is joined to the torso at the hip joint. Potter uncle first obtains good quality clay. To improve the quality of the pots, he mixes some other substances in the clay. He mixes water in the clay and makes it soft and easy to shape. This is called kneading the clay. He turns the kneaded clay on a wheel to shape the pot. The pots are baked in a kiln to make them hard. A ready pot. Seedling that grows from the sprout flourish. The plant begins to grow. It gives out new leaves and begins to grow taller. At the proper stage of its growth, the plant begins to flower. Fruits develop from the flowers. These fruits have seeds. From those seeds, new plants grow. Here, look at a handkerchief. It is a square. Fold the handkerchief in the middle from the top to bottom as well as from side to side. Now, we shall fold the handkerchief as shown alongside to find out if each corner falls exactly on the one opposite. Here, the corners matches. Now, fold the handkerchief over again. All the edges match in length. Thus, all the edges of a square are of equal length. Here, note that we got a triangle when we folded the handkerchief. Here, square A, B, C, D is shown in the figure. A closed figure having four edges and four corners where all the edges are of equal length is called a square. Then, square A, B, C, D has edges as side A, B, side B, C, side C, D and side D, A where the vertices of square are Vertex A, Vertex B, Vertex C and Vertex D. Here we have 100, 2 tenths and 1 unit which is added to 2 hundreds, 1 tenths and 3 units which on addition makes that is here we add 1 unit to 3 units which makes 4 units, 2 tenths to 1 tenths which makes 3 tenths and 100 plus 200 gives 300. And picture is shown as 300, 3 tens and 4 units. 421 plus 351. Now we arrange the numbers as horizontally, that is 100 tens units, where the number is 421 plus 100. Tens units, the number is 351, which gives answer as 772, that is 772. Now, here we first add units as for first number we add 1 to 1 of the next number's units place, which gives us 2. Then we add the numbers at tens place as 2 plus 5 which gives us 7. And the numbers at hundreds place we add as 4 plus 3 which gives us 7. There are 2 tens means 2 bunch having 10 bits each and 3 separate bits are there. And from these bits, we cancel one tens, that is a bunch of ten bits, and two separate bits, that is from units place. And the subtraction can be written as tens and units, where 23 minus 12. Now, first we subtract numbers at units place, and then we subtract the numbers from tens place, that is. 3 minus 2 gives us 1 and 2 minus 1 gives us 1. Now here by cancelling 1 10 and 2 bits from units place, we get 11 that is 1 bunch of 10 bits and 1 bit separately.
Thus, the answer is 11. We write the England score as 245 minus India's score that is 123. Now here at units place we subtract 5 minus 3 gives us 2. Then at tens place 4 minus 2 gives us 2. And at hundreds place 2 minus 1 gives us 1. Therefore the answer is 122. Then multiplication. Now here picture shows 4 boxes having 3 balls each. And that box belongs to Tony, Sonu, Nandu and Salma. Now if each of them has 3 balls, how many balls all together? That is 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 is equal to 12. An addition of 3 taken 4 times is 4 times 3. That is 4 into 3 is equal to 12. Here we consider the table of 4 that is 4 threes are 12. Here it means that as we add 3 4 times that is multiply 3 by 4 and we get answer 12. I have a 100 rupee note, 4 notes of 20 rupee and 6 coins of 1 rupee each. How much money do I have? Answer. Here we have to add all the values of notes and coins in order to get the total money. Therefore, 100 rupees plus 4 20 rupees notes. Here, as there are 4 notes of 20 rupees, therefore we add 20 4 times. That is, 20 plus 20 plus 20 plus 20 which is equal to 80. Then we add these 80 rupees to 100 rupee to get 180 rupees. Then there are 6 coins of 1 rupee which gives us 6 rupees. Therefore, we add these 6 rupees to 180 rupees in order to get rupees 186. So, you have 186 rupees altogether. Length of pencil. It is measured in centimeter. Distance between two buildings. It is measured in meter. Measure the lengths of the objects shown. First is a pencil. Answer. Length of a pencil is 10 centimeter. That is, it is 10 centimeter long. Second, a pen. Answer. Pen is 6 centimeter long. Third is a nail. Answer. A nail is 5 cm long. Exercise. Write the weight of the object with less than or more than or equal to as the case may be in the diagram. First is, observe the picture. Here, the weight of the sweet is less than 2 kg. Second, in second picture, the weight of apples is more than 1 kg. Third one is, in third picture, the weight of grapes is equal to 500 grams. A comes first and then B. Again, after B, A is there and after A, again B. Thus, the sequence is followed as A, B, A, B, A, B. A, B and so on. In the second pattern, A comes two times and then B. That is, pattern is A, A, B, A, A, B and so on. The figures are as shown. Then their axis of symmetry is drawn with the dotted line and the figures are colored with the different colors as shown.